हेलो देर हाउ यू आई होप ऑल इज वेल एंड एवरीथिंग इज एब्सोल्यूटली अमेजिंग ऑन योर एंड वेलकम बैक दिस इज योर लाइट एंड डार्कनेस एंड आई एम बैक अगेन विद न्यू इंसाइट्स न्यू अपडेट्स एंड न्यू मैसेजेस फॉर ऑल ऑफ यू सो टूडेज रीडिंग इज टॉकिंग अबाउट वट हैपन इन द पास्ट वट्स हैपनिंग एट प्रेजेंट एंड वट ऑल ऑफ यू कैन एक्सपेक्ट इन द नियर कमिंग फ्यूचर ओके और इन द फ्यूचर so it's clearly being shown here that someone in your connection made a decision about leaving this connection and moving in another direction for their friends or family or because of their friends and family this possibly happened in the past most likely it would be your soul counterpart who did that because um in majority of the cases the feminine ones are usually awakened and uh, are aware of what is going on here on the other hand the other counterparts act like this so that may have happened here that happened actually here which led to an ending in between the two of you family or friends were the real cause here because they are the devil here they are the real uh, enemies of your connection or were depending on your situation if they are still present or not so i am seeing that they interfered they filled in your counterpart's mind or whoever that left this connection because of their friends or family i am seeing that at present whatever direction they chose over you whatever connection they chose over you it didn't work out for them and never ever will okay well i see that today's reading is specially meant for those individuals for those soul counterparts who are meant to get married or share a family together okay this might also mean that you were already married and because of their friends or family you got separated or divorced okay it doesn't really matter in which group or category you fall into because your counterpart cannot find happiness or success this way okay they cannot just kick off a divine blessing a god's gift which was given to them for a higher purpose which was given to them to bring in love and harmony in their world for people like these or for some stupid reason like this they decided to choose over you okay i'm seeing that people think that your connection is already over here and uh, there's no hope left but i'm seeing that there are situations or circumstances about to come around especially for your counterpart if they got married engaged or if they went into another relationship or commitment with someone else they'll experience a ending in that connection or in that situation and then they'll be back to square one okay they'll be back to square one and they'll be put on the same spot from where they left your connection or the situation on total i'm seeing that divine intervention or divine judgment somehow is going to force your counterpart to move on or move away from the negativity and toxicity of their friends or family members okay they'll be forced to do this i'm seeing that they'll find themselves in a loop of unfortunate events endings and um, real bad happenings they'll encounter in their life because of these same people they are listening to and, and then they'll be forced to make a decision of moving on from these people and move towards you and this connection because your connection is still there and will always remain like it was forever there is no change coming in your connection because it is eternal and spiritual instead any connections any man made connections your counterpart is running behind or is choosing over you because of their friends or family members they'll always experience ending betrayal deception 
suffering and misfortune in those connections and i see that some of them are actually struggling with one right now something has really abruptly changed in that connection or something might have came out into the light which is bringing in a lot of pain a feeling of loss and uh, misfortune in their life they are not doing well they are not in a very great state they thought that by listening to their friends or family members they'll be very successful prosperous or abundant they'll attract a lot of victory or fame and fortune but exactly opposite of that is happening right now or will happen okay as i said this is also talking about what all of you can expect to happen so this outcome talks of endings misfortune and just uh, separation in any connection or direction your counterpart is going to choose over and above your divine connection because of their friends or family members or because of their um, absurd talkings opinions gossip and interference that's what i'm seeing here this is the truth so if anyone is getting triggered i cannot apologize for that because people like these do not deserve any respect who just do not want to grow in their life and they stoop to any level just to cause interference and blockages into other people's lives or their relationships they don't know nothing about these are the same kind of people here i'm talking about okay so this also feels like a follow up from the previous channelings we did recently you can listen to that you can listen to them as well which talks about interference coming from friends and family really hostile jealous envious people who do not know anything better than just showing off and you know hating others for no absolute reason just because they want to feel superior and uh, make other people feel inferior so that they can just feel good about themselves that's the kind of people i'm seeing here so a decision was made definitely where your counterpart made a decision of leaving you behind and choosing something or someone else but it wouldn't serve them they'll be back to square one they'll find themselves in the same spot your connection is going to come back again because it can never ever go anywhere i mean to say it's not like those man made connections you can dust yourself off by lying or cheating or gossiping or things like that it is eternal spiritual and it has got a purpose so i'm seeing that your counterpart is going to become so miserable that they won't have any other choice but to walk away and move on from their friends or family members these changes are going to get forced at them and those who are going through something similar like i'm talking about where they are suffering right now where they are experiencing losses huge losses not some uh, small petty losses huge losses which feel like which feels like their world came to an end and there's no hope left that's the kind of loss i'm talking about because it's going to be that huge they lose everything possibly they lose their family their um, belongings their uh, abundance their money their financial security or a loss which is going to make them feel like they can never go back a loss which is going to shatter them a loss which is going to destroy their image or reputation anything that they were very proud of anything that they kept in high regard over the blessing of your connection is going to get taken away from them and they lose it that's what i'm trying to say here they lose anything and everything they are putting over your counterpart which is of a material nature and which they chose because of their friends or families mindless and uh, hostility filled interference okay i am not disrespecting anyone here i'm just letting you know what the truth is so if anyone is getting triggered then uh, you've got some work to do so i'm seeing that they'll have to make their wrongs right otherwise they cannot expect any beautiful change to come in their life this also means that you need to be careful about uh, other people you're sharing things with or you're discussing about your connection with be careful because their interference may cause you to make decisions you'll regret later 
especially in regards to marriage and relationships okay now if you want to move on from your counterpart or whatever you want to do in regards to your personal life is your personal choice i'm just saying that first and foremost you need to understand what your connection is here for what its purpose is because i'm seeing that whoever is going to act mindlessly here whoever is going to listen to their friends or family members ridicule a negativity or toxicity or act as per their suggestions which are baseless which are completely absurd and just snide there's no basis in them they don't know nothing about your connection you'll regret later that's what i'm saying and that's what i'm seeing because it'll all come back to square one you'll find yourself in the same spot from where you'll try to leave because you'll find yourself in a never ending loop or rut okay so be careful i'm not saying that you cannot choose a better direction you need to choose a better direction for sure especially if your counterpart had made a decision of getting married or things like that you can move in a direction which is suitable for you like starting a business or venture a profession well if you want to get married it's your choice but be careful about the purpose of your connection okay don't do anything you would regret later be decisive get clear before making any such big decision about your life and uh, make sure that you take full responsibility about your life okay i'm not trying to scare anyone here i'm just saying what i'm seeing okay it's your life it's your choice first and foremost try to understand what a marriage means what your connection is trying to teach you here what the separation is trying to teach you here okay because i'm seeing a marriage here a marriage between twins twin souls twin counterparts twin flames divine soulmates okay that's what i'm seeing it'll come back if it's meant to be so this is what you need to know here yes it might be a little heartbreaking right now for you to hear something like this but i need to speak the truth so just be careful and uh, it also describes about the current state of both the counterparts no one's happy here okay those who interfered in your connection and brought an ending don't think that they'll be happy and uh, they'll live their life freely and happily it it's not happening sooner or later they'll be finding themselves in the same spot where there's a loss waiting for them a huge loss a huge unfortunate event a big painful separation or things like that well if you think that your counterpart is happy no as i said they can never replace your connection they can never find happiness they can never expect to find success by discarding a divine gift a divine blessing okay this is also something you need to keep in mind yes things are difficult yes things might be really overwhelming and uh, you might feel like it's all unfair that's why i'm saying give yourself some time before you make a very big decision about your life think about everything do research find uh, more information collect more information before you make any final decision divine is going to help you for sure but if you are still not sure about getting married or going into another commitment for now you can choose a purpose and devote yourself to that and in doing that shrimad bhagavad gita is going to help you a lot okay it's a difficult phase for a lot of you and you are not sure what you should be doing choose a direction which would take you towards your purpose because i'm seeing one way or the other if you guys are real divine counterparts you'll always be led back towards each other no matter what happens and no matter how long it might take that's what i'm seeing here so that's what i'm trying to say okay that's all this was your reading i hope you enjoyed listening to me and this brought you the clarity you were seeking and were hoping to get if so do let me know how you felt in the comment section below feel free to hit the like button and do subscribe to our channel for more such content to be readily available for all of you on a regular basis with that being said do not hesitate to follow through with the link given in the description box below if your heart says so also if any of you are interested in taking a personal reading 
kindly contact me or consult with me through way of my given email address provided in the description box below that's all i'll be back sooner than later till then take care of yourself and you will have to once bye bye